In the event that you misplace or lose your Windows 10 computer or tablet, it could be useful to have your computer display a login message similar to the one that you can see here. So in this video, we're going to show you how we enabled this feature on our computer. However, before we start, please note that in order for us to ensure that what you see in this video will work with both Windows 10 Home and Windows 10 Professional, we will be editing the registry. If we first locate and then select the search icon in the taskbar, from within search, we now need to type regedit. The search results will display a desktop application called registry editor. When we select registry editor, the following window will be displayed. You can see that this window is divided into two parts. On the left side, we have a navigation bar that displays our registry and its hierarchical structure. Then on the right side of this window, we have any registry entries relating to whichever directory we've selected in the navigation bar. Let's get started by navigating to the location where we will need to make changes to our registry. First, we need to select H key local machine and then select the chevron to expand this branch of directories. Next, we need to locate and expand the software directory and then the Microsoft directory. From within the Microsoft directory, we now need to locate and select Windows. However, as the list of entries within the Microsoft directory is rather extensive, if we highlight the top entry and then simply type the first few letters of the directory that we're looking for, we can quickly jump to the Windows directory. Within the Windows directory, we now need to find and select current version. As the current version directory is also very extensive, once again, we will select a directory and then type the first few letters of the directory that we're looking for. So within current version, we need to locate and select policies. Finally, within policies, we need to select system. In the right hand side of the registry editor window, you can see that we have all of the entries for system. We are looking for two specific entries, one called legal notice caption and the other called legal notice text. If in system, you find that you already have both string values, you will simply need to modify the data in those entries. However, as our example has neither of these entries, we will need to create two new string value entries. The first string value that we will be creating will be for the title for our login screen message, while the second string value will be for the message itself. In order to create a new string value, if from the menu bar we select Edit, then from the drop down menu highlight New, in the sub menu we will find an option called String Value. By selecting String Value, a new entry will be added to our system directory. We now need to name this entry Legal Notice Caption. Next, we need to modify this entry so that it will display the title we wish to use with our lock screen message. If we right click on our new entry and then from the quick menu select Modify, an edit string window will be displayed. In the Value Data field, we should now enter the title that we would like to use. In this example, we will type lost and found notice. When we select OK, our registry entry will be updated. We now need to create a second entry in the registry that will display the main body of text for our lock screen message. So once again, we need to create a new string value. However, this time the name for this entry will be legal notice text. We now once again need to modify our newly created string value. However, in this value field, we need to type the message that will be displayed to anyone who finds our computer. When we select OK, the message will be set and we will have two new entries in our registry. We can now close Registry Editor 
but because our changes will not take effect until after we've rebooted our computer, we will need to restart Windows. Once our computer reboots, it will display our new lost and found notice. Now, in order to log into Windows, if we select OK, Windows will either display a login screen or the Windows desktop. However, this behavior will depend on how your computer has been configured. 